and we are going to bring Dr. Sandra Lee in. I'm going to talk to Dr. Sandra Lee to talk, I'm going to talk about cleavage wrinkles. <laughs> yes, I am. We'll be right back. This question is for all of you ladies out there. Are you happy with the way your chest area looks? If not, there are some new fixes for cleavage wrinkles, and apparently it's wrinkles that are caused by excessive sun damage. Janet admits she's as vain as they come. To maintain her appearance, she's one of Dr. Sandra Lee's regulars. Now she's in with a new complaint. Well, we could fix our face, but I don't like all these lines. Dr. Sandra calls them breeses, creases that form between the breasts. One reason it happens. We spend half of our life sleeping, really, or at least a third. You, you know, obviously roll on your side and you're like, Oh, I better wake up and sleep like a mummy. The good news? I have this lovely device that you strap on you, kind of like a little baby carrier. It's called a pillow bra. Oh. And you put it on between your breasts to kind of separate them. Oh. So when you sleep, when you sleep on your side, try to turn on your side, you're not going to squish as much. Side sleeping isn't the only thing that causes chest wrinkles. Sun damage is a big problem, too. Ready? A little snap here. For that, Dr. Sandra uses the V-beam laser. It's going to help improve the redness, the discoloration, and over time, induce collagen to help to fill in those lines. V-beam treatment can require several visits and can cost up to about $1,000. The pillow bra, which is designed to prevent new damage, costs about 60 bucks, but it too has its drawbacks. Do I think everybody should have one? No, I mean, you know, yes, it might be difficult go. and it might cramp your sex life, certainly. Yes. <laughs> well, you, you've got a good point there. I mean, that's one way to tell a man you're not in the mood. Oh, Strap this that right baby here? on. Yeah. yeah. Dr. Might... Sandra Lee is here, by the way, to, to further explain this problem. And you shouldn't say that it's just for women. I mean, men might have the issue, too. It just means that oh, when you're lying on your you side, you're going to go create there. creases. Um, and, you know, you could be small breasted, you could be large breasted. Well, so no, that's a question, though. I would think that the large breasted women would have that problem more than small breasted women. I think that, yeah, that makes sense, certainly. But it's really just the position that you sleep in. So, one of the best ways, I mean, I'm not saying that I think that this thing is genius or anything, it's not necessarily going to work, but Perhaps if you lie on your back, you know, it might help too because you're not going to have any kind of creases there. I mean, they're, they're these vertical or these um, vertical creases on your chest. Or maybe um, wearing a bra, a support bra while you sleep, which may not be comfortable but may actually minimize okay, that. Okay, what, what are the other products you brought over there that are treatments? Well, what I want to make sure people know is that there's two things that are occurring here. Sun damage from overexposure to the sun. And you've seen many women, many mm -hmm. men, they might have this like V-shape uh, change in their skin from, right. from, from, from long-term sun. There's that and there's creases. So. so what There's topical it? products you can use, tretinoin. This is a prescription, but it's probably the best thing, the best anti-aging topical. Nothing works remarkably topical-wise, a cream you put on, but this is probably one of the best things. And I just wanted to show how you can see in women or men that you have the sparing in the neck. So many people have this. You have sun damage around and on their neck, but mm -hmm. not in this diamond shape underneath because your chin is sort of like an umbrella blocking the sun. So you can, you know that you're getting sun damage because this is what your skin should look like. And, the, and if you had to choose between the tretinoin Say it again, tretinoin? tretinoin. Tretinoin or the laser treatment. Is it an either or? Um, you can do both. And um, this is something that you can do that's probably less expensive. That's going to be an at home treatment. And the treatment that we showed on TV, the V beam, is something that is more expensive. You know, it's going to be $300, $500 for a treatment. These are things that people do monthly okay. and they can help long term. But, you know, it might not be for everybody. You call them breeses. Breeses, yes. And this is breeses a Breeses in between the yeah. breasts. Right. Dr. Lee, thank you very much. Of course. Courtney. <laughs> Oh, goodness. All right. Triathlon 